Welcome back everyone for more of the smites in the solo lanes and this time with Mr. Osiris. This is probably going to be the last episode before I go back to like the A to Z series stuff. Uh, I just want to, you know, I want to play some, want to play some normal warriors, get, get all this stuff done, see what it's all like in the season threes. And so far it's been fun, it's been a good time. I enjoy playing warriors, they're fun characters to play. So right off the bat I just want to say something. I'm um, starting as two here. If you watched the last time I played Osiris, I start as one, and I like starting as one more usually because you get more damage off by AA canceling. Plus the cooldown is like super short, it's like four seconds right at the beginning. But with starting back camps, you're not, you don't really have a, uh, you don't have a big minion to throw your sickle at. Like before you would throw your sickle at the big minion on speed and uh, and mana, but now there's no speed. So you're just doing all three. Um, so I figure since, I mean, you do, you could probably still start the sickle and just throw it at the. Uh, at the big minion. We start here. I don't want to do. I don't want to do picks. I don't want to go to picks. Thanks. I assume this guy might be silly and do want to go to picks. Don't go to picks. I've said. I said this in like every video in season three. Do not do picks. It's not worth. Less XP than back camps. Minions Takes longer to get to lane, small. especially against someone with such early, good early clear as shock. You want to get to lane as early as possible. And yeah, don't use... So this is kind of a personal thing. I don't think that the jungler should use an ability on back camps. Alright, I appreciate you to pull it. Yeah, I think the jungler should save... Unless it's like a super short cooldown, I think the jungler should save his ability for the, uh... For the blue buff. Let's so later just use... Oh yeah, he's doing pigs too. Feels bad. That's unfortunate. Whatever. We've had such good, such good times not doing pigs. I figure one time doing a silly start is okay. But it kind of sucks against Shock, so I'm gonna lose lane pressure really hard here. I actually didn't lose any creeps though. I lost one, I think. That's not bad. That could be a lot worse actually. I'm still gonna lose pressure, and he probably get elements for free if he wants to. But uh, I'm gonna get my three before my one. I tried to hit him there with my, my uh, autos so I could pull the wave all together. I don't want to fight him here, I just want the damage mitigation in case he threw his little axe. I'm having trouble clearing that. Where do he start? So he's got... Uh, Alright. He doesn't have any multibots. The fact that I got lane pressure against this is kind of ridiculous. There's no reason for me to have lane pressure now. Like, not only did I start pigs and he didn't do pigs, but it's Chalk. Like, he has. Chalk's all about lane pressure and early clear, and he, he's just not doing that right now. I could probably even get elementals after this. The only reason I'm doing my three right there is just so that in case he tries to hit me with his uh like I know he's gonna throw his axe when he can to clear the wave. In case he tries to hit me with it, I'll have the damage mitigation, so it'll take less damage from it. Also his pigs are up, but I don't know if I want to aggress into that just yet, just because it's chalk. And I mean Osiris has really good early game, but I think chalk is better, so. He could just like throw out yeah, I think oh he's trying to steal elementals. If he was smart, he would have just gone to his pigs, I think. I think that would have been the better call on his part, but that's fine with me. Attack. Now I can probably do his picks. He has to the whole wave. Although it is chalk, so it'll take like two seconds. I don't know if I can actually clear these before he comes over. I mean, I can't even come. Like, he could have just. If he has an axe on cooldown, he probably could have just thrown over the wall and stolen those. Bah. That's not really stealing them if they're his to begin with, but. Your middle tower, first blood. That's too bad. Your left tower is under attack. I don't actually think I can kill him. I just kind of want to poke him out, make him uncomfortable. His blue should be up Enemy now too. Middle. Enemy has been slain. Oh. Your left tower is under attack. 
Did he not start bluestone? He did. I don't know why I'm not getting hit by it. I don't know if it's a glitch or it's supposed to happen, but like a lot of the times when Shock teleports to his hammer, if he goes through you when he teleports, you get hit with a blue stone. So I guess you take damage from that, which I never knew before, until blue stone became a thing. And yeah, I don't want to... I could probably go and try and steal the blue here, but... I don't know where uh, Kali is. So I'm going to try to just get mine and be safe. I think he's probably going to be doing his right now. I mean, I got his boar, so I got something from him. Um, at least a level ahead of oh, okay. I'm like three quarters of a level ahead of him. Enemy missing middle. And he I actually didn't miss on that much if he comes right now. Yeah, he only missed two creeps, which isn't bad. Now I'll do elementals and then wave then boars and back. Which means he'll probably get his next set of boars if he get if he goes to one cooldown. But that's okay. Enemy missing left. The fact that I got lane pressure back after doing that start is really good. Really good for me. I'm gonna try and group these so I get them all. Am I right side? Yeah. Right. I got confused there. I always get confused for some reason I'm facing the wrong way. I think he might be just doing his boards now. He had his blue last time I saw him. Yeah, he must have just done his boards. Yeah, I'm still about three quarters of level ahead of him. Hopefully I don't miss these creeps. I missed one, I think. I'll do one more wave than back. He does have teleport, so if he did back, he should be coming soon. Unless he's doing his boards. Oh, he's doing his boards now. All right. Maybe he didn't have his blue last time. It just looked like he did. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. All are possible. I'm gonna see if I can fight him a little bit. Alright, he's super low. That sucks. And he just used his ult. Fine for me. Actually, I'm just gonna stay. There's no reason for me to back now. He's gonna have to back. I can just push this wave for free. Alright, now I'm gonna back. Ah, oh, goddamn, I wanna do elementals though. If they spawn while I'm here, I'll do them, but if not, it's not worth it. Yeah, whatever, I'll just back. This will suit me well. I'm gonna keep stocked up on these though. I don't really need wards just yet. I don't think they're not rotating on me. I should be safe, wardless. The only reason I'd really want wards, he's just missing creeps for this. The only reason I'd want wards is to uh I oh, should probably go doing elementals, but yeah, like he missed at least one melee creep, which is worth almost the same as all of the elementals. If that's what he was rotating to. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. I think his blue might be up. Nope, not up yet. That's okay. He missed out on way more XP than he gained in that rotation. Oh, it's our playing. He's kind of caught out now. I don't know if he's staying there. I might be able to just proxy this next wave. Enemy missing right. If he's here now. Eh, I can do his boards though. This fun. Impressive killing spree. After this, I'll see if I can rotate for his blue. Unless he's going for it now. Alright, I was trying to do his blue. I don't know where Callie is. She was mid. So this might be really, oh she's still mid. This might still be really dangerous though. If they rotate on me, I can just leave it. I don't really need it. An enemy has been slain. Did I get it? Nah, he got it. That sucks. Oh well. I mean it's not much, but at least there's still like one one extra creep from him. Forced him to rotate. He just wastes his clear on me. Could do my blue now. Your middle tower is under attack. I'm just scared because Chalk is gonna be so good at stealing camps or securing camps. I'll hold this for the Arcwing. Shouldn't have shouldn't have held it. That was my fault.
Well, that's their Vulcan. Yeah, there's no reason to fight this now. That kind of sucks, though. He missed out on more than me for it, but he got my blue, which is upsetting. So I still got a lead on him, which is nice. I might go weakening second item or second active to deal with his heals. I don't want to build into anti heal items so much. I can get I can back for breastplate, but I'm gonna wait a little bit longer. Enemy missing metal. He has caught up a little bit in farm. I guess with those two blue buffs, it helped him. Now he's only like half a level behind, whereas before he was like three quarters of a level behind. I don't think Vulcan's a good character. Sorry, not Vulcan. I don't think uh, that guy's a good character. I, I can come in. Oh, Killing I, maybe we can kill this Kali though, if the Aquang jumps on us. Dang it! I want to kill. That kind of sucks to get that. All right, dude. We got it. That'd be worth then. I'm just gonna leave. Bye. I don't think we can Enemy kill the shock. Oh, I actually took a lot of damage there, but I have no idea. No, uh, what should we call it? Mana's. A mana buff got stolen. I'm gonna alt. Do my alt last, I think. I don't. Is alt more for like. Oh, what the heck? Why is he pushed up that far? I use his alt more for like repositioning than for the damage, and even just like the anti heal than the damage. So I feel like leveling up is not as worth it. I'm just gonna back though. Get my breastplate did. Something to keep me together, huh? An ally has been slain. Rampage. Get some of uh, these things. So our cube is kind of getting worked on, but the attack wings getting kind of big, which is good. I'm gonna. I think we just ward the blue buffs. I think I like Callie's not rotating on me at all, so I don't need to worry about that. I just want to know if I can steal him. The blues. Oh, he took his. There's pigs up? No, it's pigs are not. I'll just pour it. I'll work here then. I'll go do my blue. Make sure he doesn't come over this time. I guess I'm not going to ward the blue bus. I'm going to pour it here. Ah. Pour it here. Enemy missing left. Yeah, this Kali's doing a lot of work too, though, which kind of sucks for our team. But an enemy has been slain. Your right tower is under attack. Enemy missing right. The Alquain Kali battle is going to be pretty intense. TBH, it's because they're both super OP and broken. It shouldn't be in the game. All right, now I have. I might still be like half level. I don't know. I'm gonna miss my sickle like twice in a row there. I'm bad. There, right in his face, right in his stupid, dumb, idiot, jock face. Alright, he's still pretty close to me in levels. I don't think I can kill him. I just want to poke him as much as I can. It's annoy him. If I'm going in for the kill, that's when I'll use my weakening. But I don't want to waste it by using it when he's not killable. An enemy has been slain. Thanks. I can also use my alt to kill him. Not to kill him, but to like stop his heals. Away. An enemy has fallen. I don't like keep poking him. So he has to keep using his heal like that. That'd be good. Enemy missing right. I don't know what he was doing there. He might just ward it. He was yeah, he could have just warded. 
gonna do my boars. You might be able to steal them, to be honest, because again, it's chalk, and that's what he does. He just steals things. He's a big loser. Big loser idiot. But. I'm gonna pull him back here if we can't get him with axe to bless him. Sorry, didn't even come. That's good. He might just be doing his. <clears throat> if we just split boars, like if he does his and I do mine, that's a win for me, I think. Because Chalk's, er, er, Chalk's late game is poop, and my late game is beats. I'm gonna see if I can steal this over the wall. Damn it. His blue just spawned. So I don't, I don't want to rotate it to it when they have two in mid, we have zero in mid. An enemy has been slain. Hey, look at that. The Cupid got a kill. Good job, Mr. Cupid. An enemy has fallen. As much as I want to steal his blue, I just want to make sure I get my blue. I think that's more important to me. I'll push this wave and go for my blue. He's gonna do his. Yeah, screw you that now. And this way, I don't miss out on XP from the wave, and he can't rotate on me without losing a wave. So it's worth. Enemy missing right. Enemy missing left. Yeah, and I got my blue. I'm gonna do one more wave in the back. Nothing's really up over here, so it's a good time to. And I can work on my not root forge, frostbound hammer. That's what it's called. The one that people actually buy. It's a good one. So now my boars are up because they spawn every two seconds. I'll go do the. Uh, I'm gonna do the wave. I'm gonna do the wave and then not fight him and go do boars. I don't want to get that XP. Keep my small lead on him. I think his boars are up too. So I assume he'd go to his before he'd go to mine, but he could be a butt and rotate to mine. Looks like coming up. I also don't want to miss this wave. Enemy missing right. I can also I can also just TP over there, but I think they're doing fine. Yeah, I don't need to TP over there. This should be okay. All right. Got my frostbound, starting some magical defenses. Keep those, I'm gonna get some more rewards, I guess. Make sure I don't get caught out by this Kali if she wrote a touch rotate over, if I become a target. I'm guessing he's doing elementals. I'm gonna call him this thing. See, that's the annoying thing. And that's why, I, one of the reasons why I say. Hey, do every time you can just rotate into the jungle and get stuff. Oh, that's there goes someone. Pally. That's, that's good. I just don't have to worry about jungle pressure now. You see, that's one of the annoying things about if you're like up on your farm as a soul laner and you just keep rotating over to get whatever camps are up as soon as you can. Like you push a wave and leave lane. Then the enemy is like, I don't know, do I call missing or what? Like they just keep leaving the lane. I don't think they're just doing camps. See if his boards are up. I think he did them when I did mine. Yeah, they're down. I'll just ward his blue. Enemy missing right. Hey, I got him. I was really confused about the sprints. I don't know who popped sprint there. But we got the kill. And his blue's up. All good. I'm guessing it's not going to last too much longer though if the Kali doesn't come back. 
I guess their team's gonna surrender, but it's still fun. I don't know why he rotated all the way to back camp today. Like the only reason I went over was because I assumed he was rotating to mid and I wanted to help out my mid laner if he got caught out, but he wasn't. He was just going for back camps. He didn't even stop when he saw me there. That was weird. And I got a two level lead on him. Or at least like level and a half or something. I can do his boars. Before he gets up. Or before he TPs in. I think his TP might actually be down still. He back from the same time I did. Oh no, he's stuck. But got his boars. Got his blue. All's well. I don't know if I actually need to use my weakening there, because I also ulted him. Right, I think. I honestly, I already forget how to the fight. I'm pretty sure I ulted him and I hit him. So he had no healing anyways. So using the weakening was kind of overkill. For the slow. I'm fine in box with him here, because I can back soon with TP. I have Bulwark, so I want to back sooner rather than later anyways. Yeah, I don't really want to fight this. Maybe I'll see my blue here. Oh, we won. Hey, good job, teammates. I think it helped. I think back to the Cal DC is the reason we won, to be honest. But I think we we're going to win anyway with the 13 and 1 up playing, even though our cube was getting worked on. That was fun. Warriors are good times in the solo lane. So after this one, like I said, I'm probably next video is probably just going to be Bacchus going, to, going back to the A to Z series. I just kind of want to take, not that I'm not enjoying it, I am really enjoying it. I just want to take a break quick and play some Warriors in season three, to test it out, to try out some, try out some gods and whatnot, see what they're all about. Because, you know, Season 3 is brand new. A lot of new stuff. Less rotations. More stealing camps. More invades. More early lane pressures. It's fun. It's good times. The bad thing about this is I do, like, no damage now because I'm not rotating. But I have damage to Chalk. So, you know, I have damage to Chalk and the Vulcan. That's good. I'm content with that matchup. I kind of wish it lasted longer. I wish the Kali didn't DC, but whatever. What can you do? Sometimes people leave the game. Sometimes they get angry. Or sometimes they just don't want to play anymore. Or their internet breaks, you know? You never know what it is. But anyways, that's it for me. Thank you for joining. Hope you enjoyed. And I hope to see you again for another episode in a little while. Probably next one will be Bacchus. Almost definitely. It'll be A to Z Bacchus. So yeah, take care everyone.